respectful squad. Margaret, be respectful. And before you start watching this video, don't forget to subscribe, like, leave a comment down below. Give me that thumbs up, guys. I'm doing today, as you see, my hair is in the goddess dreadlocks, loose waves. And I got some little hair jewelry. I got more to add in. And I left a braid undone to show you guys how to install them. I'm doing crotchet. Right in the goddess dreadlocks loose waves. Yes, guys, it's a 16 inch. Mm -hmm. And it's Natty's goddess dreadlock loose waves, 16 inches. This is the last bag. I have five bags. This is four in my head. I got a couple. Let me see. One, two. I got like three half. Ain't too much longer than my finger. Longest. I'm oh, sorry. Ain't too much longer than my longest finger. Uh, left in the back. Three braids. But I got to do over here. Look at the. I gotta do this braid right here, and I left this braid undone to show you guys how I'm installing it. And the pattern of my hair is I French braided my hair going to the back. I got 10 French braids, and I bought five packs of this hair, and it seemed to be filling it in. Because ain't too many gonna go on to this, anyways. Ain't too many gonna go on here, anyways. Ain't too many gonna go on there, so. And um, that's a small braid. So it la it went, it was enough for my whole head. And my head not small, as you see. No, it's not small. Okay, guys, let's get started. Let's see it better with the plastic off. See? Let's see it better without the plastic off. 16 inches. I didn't think five packs was going to be enough. Because I got a, got a big head, y'all. And I didn't think five packs was going to be enough, but it really was. It was enough, guys. It was enough. It was enough. And uh, let's install. I'm going to show you guys how to install. For this side, you start with your left hand to go down for your right side. And it has to be closed. The crotchet needle has to be closed when it go in. Open it. Okay, it has a hold. You see the hold on the end of the lock? I got the one with the little waves on the end. So we stick the needle through the hole. Close it up on it. Pull under the hair, keep the needle in it, pull it, push it through, because we're going to grab the end of the lock, put it in the loop, and close it, pull it through the hole. Put this down. Pull it on through, y'all. Oh, I'm kind of messing it up. Pull it through. There we go. Pull it through and tighten it. You see how tight it is to the braids? There it is. It's in. And we're going to take another one. Okay. I'm going to take the needle, put it through. Okay, we're going to grab hold to the loop. Oh. I don't like when it does that. This is the loop. Guys, let me turn around. That's the loop right there. You're going to grab all to the loop. Put the loop onto the needle. Make sure it's all, it all goes in there. Clamp down and close it on the hair. Loop. Bring the crochet needle on through the loop. Because you're going to grab the end of the... You're getting ready to grab the end of the lock. Put it in. 
and then lock it in and bring it on through the loop of the crotch bra. And now we're going to tighten it up again. Ooh. There we go. We're going to we install it too. Yes. We're going to install it too. I got 10 fresh braids in my hair, like I said. And I'm doing the last one. They don't just take anything no more than probably four can go on here. Five. Pull it through. Grab the end. Push the needle all the way through the loop. Close it on the end. Pull it through the loop. Let it go and pull. Pull tight to your head, to the first spray. And the longer end, pull outward. Now hold the knot with your two fingers and press it towards the French braid. And that's how you tighten it. Okay. So, um, what do more I got to do? Let me see. Oh. Only one. Because I told you this braid is short but i'm gonna take my braid and pull it pull it no actually i'm gonna take this end of this braid and take it under to the back to to the next braid and pull it in like that to hide it i could have folded it and did it like that but the braid is actually longer than the french braid so it's because it's just the corner of the edge of my head and the braid is actually longer than the French braid. So, look, the French braid come all the way out here and the braid does it. So, I'm going to connect it to the next row. To the left. Okay, I'm going the wrong way. Let's put the needle down in under the French braid. Some people put it through the French braid. I put it under the French braid because my French braid is not that tight. But it's tight enough, but it's not that tight. You want to take the loop, hook it onto the needle, crochet needle, and then we're going to lock it in, pull the needle up from underneath the braid with the loop, open the needle up, push the needle all the way through the loop, see, the needle's all the way through the loop. Put this on the end of the loop, clamp it in, and pull it through the loop, and we're going to take these two fingers right here, pull it down on the loop, and pull it outward with this hand, on to lock, and tighten it. There we go. Guys, it's very simple to do crochets, and definitely, you can do anything that has these loops on it. You can crochet them into your hair. You can crochet them into single braids. Braid your hair in single braids. And then pull the braid down through the crochet. I'll do that style one day. But it's time consuming right now. And I don't want to do it. I don't want to. I don't want to do it. No. You can't make me. I don't want to. No. I don't wanna. Wait a minute, guys. I don't wanna take this braid underneath. I'm gonna put this in the loop. Take it underneath the braid, like I said. That's what I'm do. Take it under. Oh, it's not on in it. Oh, we can time can tell me. Come on, guys, we gotta have me just done. I don't want this video to be too long. Because it didn't take me long to do these project braids. Not at all. So. Let's go ahead and do this. Okay, let's grab the braid. Put it in the loop. Close the clamp on it. 
put it under the braid. And if you like, you can actually leave it under the braid. You don't have to worry about it. It's not like you're combing the hair and it's going to fall out the braid. And I got a few more to put in the back, guys. But yes, I'm just coming on to let you know that the new style I'm doing for my hair using the Natty Goddess Dreadlocks Loose Waves 16 inch from the hair store. So guys, yes, this is what we, this is what I'm working with. What I'm working with, but I got a part over here, side part. Mm -hmm. And I got some hair jewelry. I got to finish putting in. I just want to stop through and let you guys see the new hairdo in the and how I installed it. Installing the Natty. Goddess dreadlocks, loose waves, and jewelry. Yeah, jewelry. I'm gonna add more. I'm gonna add more. I have them in my container. These come off my old braids I had in my hair. So, yes. Give me reuse. No, I didn't buy any new ones because I bought new hair. No. No, I did. No, I did not. Like I said, guys. Respect starts with you. Come on here and join the respectful squad. Migra be respectful. Installing the, what I say? Goddess Dreadlocks Loose Waves today. And I was showing you how I did it on this last braid. And when you see me again, I have more of the hair jewelry in. And I'm going to go ahead and finish the back the back. I mean, it's, it feels full, you know. But I got braids back here. I got like three braids I have to finish. Mm -hmm. I like them. They, oh, and they so lightweight. They look heavy. Mm -mm, not at all. I know they're in my head, but it's real light, guys. Very lightweight. So, you will love them. If you don't like to feel like you got a lot of hair in your head, you will not. No, you will not feel like you got a lot in your head. Mm -mm. No, you won't. I got to tame them to stay how I want them. You know, they're new, fresh. Mm -hmm. So... Yes, thanks for watch thanks for watching guys. Don't forget to subscribe, like, leave a comment down below, share with your social media, and go ahead and watch the other videos I have uploaded. Mark would be respectful. And check out the you can go ahead and watch either one of the videos right here. And right here. Heart with the kids. Peace.